author's point of view. This is not good. Rim said when she was, she saw the scenario in front of her eyes. She sat trembling and sweating like hell. She was debating whether to go there and apologize or not, but suddenly a harsh voice made its way to her ears, which lets no option for her to but went towards the person whom it belonged. Tehong, what the hell? Who is the event manager? Tehong said clear and loud enough to hear by everyone. He is not the person who forgives easily and any mistake. And when it comes to mistake, he always makes sure let the person pay for the mistake as he, as he demand for. Event manager Rim started trembling even more while looking towards Taehong. Well, she knows who is Kim Taehong and what repu- reputation she had in business world. So even she was freaking like a hell, but she still start to walk towards the direction of town because she knows if she didn't show up there, it will make situation even more worse than it is already. While all this drama, she was stuck there like a statue. She didn't know what to say or what to do. Where she was thinking to see the person who make her heart flatter by his touch and whenever she was witnessing the warmth of that person, it made her heart clench at the side to see how he was acting like an arrogant man who was humiliating a poor waiter without scared of who was scared of death. He didn't want to see this, he hated to admit, but deep down in his heart, he always wished that the gentle yet passionate feeling she had felt that night had touched her heart. She was wishing that the person might feel the same. Passion about that and looking at Taehyung's behavior, she immediately concluded how egoistic and arrogant man is and it was possible for him to feel something like that. For him it might be another one night stand. It made all of a sudden ache in his heart at this thought. Taehyung's rough voice brought her back. To the reality, he looked towards him and the sight in front of made her blood boil. It didn't look, took a second for her to walk towards the Taehyung and snap at him who was harshly speaking to Rim about how irresponsible she and her staff is while Rim was continuously apologizing to him, which he didn't bother to listen and still commit harsh harsh words at his staff once they reached immediately cut off their home for his words which made everyone shock who were the person in the room including Tai Hong himself and said Excuse me, sir. I think it is enough for you, your judgment towards this lady and her staff, whom I think have met first time, but still said how irresponsible staff they have and how they don't know how to manage the event. If everybody was surprised to see the guts of this girl, will be a lie. Everyone in the room snapped their eyes towards the girl who was in front of Kim Taehong and was equally glaring at him as he was to her. It was like two competing were competitors were competing for the same thing. Indeed, Taehong was amused by the girl's of small frame in front of him. 
but more of amusement it make him angry because she meddle in his matter without his concern which make taehun snap back to her in sing tune in which she speak and who are you to meddle in between my business like this last time i checked nobody asked you to enlighten me about how good this management team is I know that Mr I'm sorry I don't know your name you didn't ask me to enlighten you about how irresponsible the event management staff could be but as the sensible social being I it is my responsibility to see around that if everything is all right if everybody around me as behaving like a social being or not Last time I checked your behavior was not social at all sir as a responsible human being it may be duty to correct you and show you how to behave like one civil person don't you think too how dare you to call me uncivil don't you know who i am or this is the way this is the chief way to get my attention towards you i know girls like you behaving like mother teresa but on the other on my one word you will strip that civil behavior of yours and could not complete his words because of sudden suddenly a hand met his right cheek and next thing knows a girl in front of him was looking him like a much hatred and disgust it was same look he was giving to rim and the waiter few minutes before this sight in front of him made him weird sensation in his heart but soon it faded as the pretty figure in front of him start talking how dare you who dare you to said those words for my self character from that filthy mouth of yours who do you think you are you have no idea how my character is and i think nobody means I, nobody gave you right to speak about my character first before pointing a finger at my character see yourself i can say that the highly moralful character of yours will be not moralful do you know with whom you are talking i can make your life hell Yeah that is the only thing which you 50 rich arrogant person can do and you know what i really don't care stop it is enough of drama said more like a whisper when she was where this is leading she was not worried about her event management company but she was worried about the job because she knows kim tae hong is and what he can do with the career of if he wants to and she can't risk that and especially when is expecting a child it is really making thing hard if she went wrong side of tae hong but he i said stop please for me so the lead pleading eyes of rim which were begging her to stop whatever she want to said sighed and cleared last time before stomping out from there tang was glaring at the figure going which went out without giving a single glance back at him he spent his eyes towards the trembling figure who was still apologizing him about the accident and also ap- apologized the behavior of he didn't give about her apology and went away from her with the determination to break that attitude of the girl who 
dare to disrespect full towards him and not to forget slap him in front of everyone he knows nobody will dare to say a word about it but still he take it as his insult but the girl who is full of herself and didn't give damn about other he made a promise to make himself that girl paying for this insult in very cruel way nobody now the only thing he wants to break that attitude and self sustain of that girl and make her beg for forgiveness came out from event hall her tears start to make her way from her do big eyes which those words of the hang make her heart a deep wound she didn't know if her heart is aching because of those words or because of the hang is the one who said those words to her she was not expecting this from him especially after a beautiful moment they had shared maybe she is the only one who considered them special for him she was another girl with whom she had shared a night and forget her life he had never met her before she really thought maybe he will stop once he will saw her there but his reaction was like he had never seen her before knowing her was far away at the way he insulted her make her feel cheap she was thinking how could she let her gods off for the person like him she start to walk aimlessly i shouldn't be hurt like this should it it's not like i like him or i was expecting anything from him but still why it hurts like maybe it is because now i know i will never tell him this secret which i am carrying along with me or maybe it was because i don't know what i am going to say to my baby when he or she will ask about his or her father i can tell him that his father was the first person who point a finger to my character what a irony it is until morning i was praying heavens to let me meet him again so i could tell him about this but now when i meet him all i wish was that i never met him again by that at least his image in my mind were not that degre- not would be degraded like this but now i really think how low i fell in my standards let my gods off for the person like him how don't know to respect moment think for once before throwing any harsh comment to someone and didn't care how they will feel or how they gonna affect them i don't know when i am going at the moment but i was to clear my mind fire all this from him thanks point of view as i left the so called event i directly went towards jimin and jungko and sat down at the table both of them were looking at me with smug smile on their face which i don't like a bit and snapped at both of them why are you two smiling like a fool Jimin no we are not tahu oh yeah i think i imagine i imaginary waves then why are you being so gummy then what caught your eyes so funny 
It's not funny, but amusing to see how that little figure was able to make everyone stunned by her words. Shut up, Cook. It's not amusing at all. She was just trying to get my attention of everyone. Really? I don't think so. But if you are saying that, I think he got quite successful in that. Stop talking nonsense, you two. You have no right to comment like that. What she was trying to do. So stop this. Really, German, you are also taking her side. Even you are my friend. How amazing friends are you don't? They, I don't take anybody's side. Especially not of that girl whom I ever meet. But I said is true because nobody has right to comment. On someone's character without knowing him or her to the extreme to actual passing any comment of his or her self-respect yeah nobody has right to comment on someone's character but has everyone has a right to slap anyone in front of you yes what I mean no you are right but they there was your fault because you were Degrading her self-respect in front of everyone. So everyone respect lady had did same as she did. So yes, I think she didn't did anything wrong. At least not in my eyes. Really? This is just unbelievable to know how my own friends is just saying that you are talking in wrong me just listen to me no German listen to me that girl just slapped me in front of everyone and you are talking her taking her side I was expecting this from you I didn't mean it mean to offend you but I just said I don't want you to do anything which you will regret later on. So I tried to say that there was not her mistake. I got it. But let me tell you. I never regret any action. I will never regret any in future. Also about that stupid girl. I will make sure she will think hundred times before marrying in my business. And also I will never let her forget her big mistake she did by slapping me in front of everyone 